Gamer76. Hello everyone, I'm the Gamer76 and this is my 54th ever video. And before I introduce the video, don't worry about the box that's usually here. Right here. Okay, see, there's Charles. I just thought I had enough squishies to make it exclusively squishies up here. Dustle this so you know which number of video it is. Anyways, today I'm doing a dollar store makeover of three birdhouses. One with a circle hole. You can barely see the difference in the shadows. One with two circle holes. And one with a heart. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. It's Christmas themed because it's December. Um, anyways, enjoy the video. Hello. Please ignore the paper. I haven't changed it since my last video. Oh hey, the first birdhouse. And I uh, also broke the, the top a bit. It got a bit crushed. <gasps> a sticker. Nice. Here is some sandpaper. It is super coarse because I need it to be coarse for squishies. So now I'm getting a really small piece of it because it will last longer and it's easier to hold. The reason I got the sandpaper was because there is some scraggly bits in the hole. So now I'm gonna sand that down. Then I got a palette and some brown and orange. So I'm gonna mix those together for a gingerbread color because I'm making these into gingerbread houses. Isn't that clever? Dipping my brush in, then in with the first stroke. And then I covered the whole thing in that gingerbread color. And then I grabbed my matte Mod Podge, and I poured some of it out, and putting that on the house, because gingerbread is matte, and this is meant to be gingerbread. And no, I'm not done already. I have more to add, but no more flat painting. And here it is, all nice and almost matte. Then I grabbed my white puppy paint, so I can add some 3D icing, because I thought it would look good. Starting out with a line on the top. And now for the stressful bit, the shingles. Okay, breathe, and... Hmm, that wasn't so bad. And now I'm doing the rest of the shingles on the roof. I actually had to ask my mom if those were, would be called shingles. I messed up on so many words for that sentence. I also did the edges of the roof, and then I did lines of white in the places that would have icing in real gingerbread houses. Also around the hole. I tried to add windows, but I didn't like them, so ignore them. I had to make more gingerbread color to go over where the windows were, which messed up my matte finish. But I think I went over it again with matte, so don't worry. Then I brought in my gold, which I had before, then my silver, which I did not have before. Today is its debut performance. And now for one gold dot. You're too slow, go faster. So as you can see, or maybe not because it's hard to see on camera, I am alternating silver and gold on the connecting bits and it ended up being kind of a diagonal pattern. Just something fun to point out. And then I alternated sin silver and gold around the hole. <laughs> and then still alternating, I put some dots up the edges. That's it finished. Here it is on my family's piano for some reason. Here is the second birdhouse with- And this time I'm jumping straight into the painting, but that's only because I forgot to sand. And then I remembered, so I grabbed the sandpaper to do the sanding. And then I continued with the painting. I ran out of paint, so here is me making more. <laughs> and then I finally finished the painting. So it's time for the icing. And this roof, I did the exact same style of the roof as the first one. But don't worry, the last one isn't the same. I also did the trim, just like the first one. Also the edges, because I have to be realistic. Around the holes, 
Now that the white is done, I got some red and green. And the dots are not in the same pattern as the first one, they alternate rows. And then I added red dots to the top circle and green dots to the bottom circle. I also alternated the colors on those corners. And I will mention, I imagined this as a townhouse kind of thing. And this is coming out on the same day as The Sims 4 4 Rent, which I will not be getting because I can't afford it, but I acknowledged it. And that's it done with the other one. And now it's time for the third one, which has the heart hole. And this one has some chunks out of it. I actually sanded it first this time, and then painted it. And poof, it's completely coated in matte now. So I can go in, oh, I got paint in my hair. Anyways, I can go in with the white, and this time I did rectangular shapes on the roof instead of curves. See, I told you it was different. Also the edges, like the other two, because they are a set. <laughs> and then I added white to the exact same places as I did on the other two. Isn't this so fun and exciting for you? Being the same every time. I messed up the lines around the hole, so I had to wipe that off and paint over it. Twice. <laughs> After all of that is dry, I did some touch-ups where I messed up, and finally didn't mess up around the heart. Then I got some pink and white for the roof decorations. And again, I made them alternating in rows because it was easier. And I did some dots on the hole, but later I made some of the dots larger because it looked bad with some big and some small. I did the same thing around the corners like the other two. And here are all three of them together. And here it is with the one I did last year, not in a video. And on that one I ran out of white and had to use purple and paint it white, and I did that sloppily. So the new one is much better, definitely. <laughs> so that's finished. I put them over here. I also put the one I did last year, but it's not as good, so I hate it. Anyways, do you like my yellow shirt? <laughs> that's not important. Uh, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If it's your birthday, happy birthday, and goodbye.